Historically, we were more passive, but through Yao Ming, we were able to introduce hundreds of millions of people to the NBA. If we can help train other great players... It yeah, smart move. Thanks, Allie. And the starting group for the Celtics. Brown and Tatum are the explosive wing pair. Horford and Williams together in the front court. And it's smart in at the one. And for Miami, on the wing, it'll be Hero and Butler. And Adebayo is out there with Caleb Martin. And it's Lowry in at the point guard position. And both teams tonight, unafraid to run offense through their bigs, Grant. Talk about the value of being able to do that. Yeah, B.A., you know, it just speaks to how both teams can beat you in multiple ways of playing. I think it can lead to higher percentage looks with the bigs running the offense. You can strike a nice balance between inside and out, which coaches are preaching right now. Now here's Brown. The shot off that time. Good D by Adebayo. Butler passes to Adebayo. Some solid defense from Williams. And here's Boston. Pass to Tatum. Williams, a screen on hero. Tatum from long range. Horford for three. Sinks it from distance. You hear the term stretch four right there. Horford from the perimeter. Lowry, the pass to Adebayo, and that comes off the assist by Lowry. And setting the tempo with an assertive move, like, where was the defense on that play? Yeah, APB sent out to try to find out where the defense is. Inexcusable. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. Yeah, you never want to let shots at the rim go uncontested. Shooting from Austin. Marcus and he can't get the first one. And he can't make the second free throw either. Missed them both. Hero for three. It doesn't go for him. And Boston going the other way now. Pass to Tatum. Butler against Brown. Horford with it. Shoots over Hero. Boston again missing. Just over a minute and a half in. Butler with the ball. Picked up by Tatum. A shot by Butler. No good. He creates such a great opportunity right at the rim, and he just can't get it to go, even with the defense not really a factor. Now here's Tatum. From 11 feet away, and the jumper falls for him. A versatile, outstanding score. Tatum knows he can do damage from the mid-range area. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Adebayo. They get it back. Second chance effort. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance at a three-point play. Well, he seems to be in the right place at the right time. More often than anybody that's on the court here tonight. We see that pay off. First, First team foul. Now the line. Free throws good. Adebayo. And the Adebayo experiment has been pretty awesome to watch just because it's gone nuclear. All the skills and his hard work paying off now. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Tatum. Butler 
against Tatum. Oh, it's blocked by Williams. Hero against Brown. And Kyle Lowry is going to pick up the foul. That's his first foul of the game. It's time to take a glance again at that superb block. And that kind of rejection early on energizes your squad. The coaching staff just loves this kind of hustle. Just over two and a half minutes played here in the first. Horford, a screen on Butler. Back to Smart. Fires for three. And it's Martin with the rebound. The Heat have gone two for seven. A sluggish start. Here's Butler. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. That's on Al Horford. Felt like he was getting more and more hungry as he got closer to the rim. Jimmy Butler just tenacious there. And that one drops. So now they lead by one. Love is checked in for Adebayo. Williams is checked in for Boston. White comes in for Tatum. At this point, you might as well go ahead and chalk up the points when he's at the free throw line. Pretty much automatic. Smart passes to Horford. Brown against Butler. Williams a screen on Butler. Outside, Williams. Down to five on the shot clock. Boston, no good that time either. <laughs> and I'm surprised that didn't go down. I mean, I'm sure he is too. Hero knowing about the wins and the wares for an assist. Boston's gone one for three from beyond the arc. Love against White. Shot to stop the run. Goes up again. Smart for three. Rebound by the Heat. And he's not the guy that you want to give a wide open look for three point range. They're lucky that that one doesn't cost them. Here's Butler. And that'll be Miami's ball as it goes out of bounds. Heat able to keep the possession. And the Heat with some changes. Robinson, he's checked in for Jimmy Butler. Victor Oladipo comes in for Hero. And Vincent is subbed in for Lowry. 116 left to play in the first. Love inside. Covered by Muscala. Here's Hauser. Pass to White. To the wing on the left. Just five on the clock. Hauser. Second chance shot. Muscala, no good. The Heat have gone only three for nine from the floor. Down low. Here's Love. Drops in the layup for two. That's a nice touch from Kevin Love. When he's deep inside like that, he's adept at guiding those shots home with a soft touch. White drives in, and it's good. Two points. And we've got 28 seconds left in the opening quarter. Here's Vincent. Good work defensively by White. Boston trailing. Pass to Brogdon. Here's Hauser. Three-pointer. That one doesn't drop. And so the first quarter is in the books. Heat out in front, leading by four. And we'll be back in just a minute with the start of the second quarter. Just joining us, we played through one quarter of action so far. And a look now at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the Heat. Ever since this game started, they've been attacking on the inside, looking for ways to bust up the defense and get high percentage looks. I love the passing that they displayed at the start of the game. Great ball movement that's opening up some chances without really getting deep into the execution. The Heat with the lead. Lowry and Hero in the backcourt. Jimmy Butler out there with Caleb Martin. And it's Adebayo in at the five. 